Hello, today we're trying out the uh, Four Sigmatics um, Mushroom Ground Coffee Beans. Um, it's uh, basically they're, they're adding mushrooms as well as probiotics and I believe prebiotics. Um, but basically it's just that it's their Defend version, it's supposed to help with your immunity system, overall well-being. Um, I know what you're thinking, mushrooms in coffee, right? How could that possibly go together? But um, they do say that you're not supposed to be able to taste the mushrooms and um, we're about to try it out right here and, and kind of let you know how their coffee tastes. So this is just brewed in a, a Keurig um, using one of the refillable cups. Um, so we'll, we'll try it like this and see how it, how it does. It's a, a very um, bold flavor, kind of more of a, a robust, kind of a darker roast. I'm thinking kind of like the French roast type uh, flavor palettes. Um, no taste of mushrooms at all whatsoever. Um, doesn't really taste like, I would even say, a, a probiotic or a prebiotic. It just tastes like coffee. Um, so I think the, the wonderful bold flavor that it has tends to hide or cover up all those other things. And I'm not even sure if those other mushrooms and probiotics even have flavor to begin with. But I uh, would strongly recommend this for anybody who enjoys a very robust, flavorful cup of coffee. Um, so please check this out for its immunity bo boosting support as well as getting your caffeine in the morning. And if you don't like black coffee, uh, almond milk should go well in it. Definitely. I would think um, any uh, coffee additive creamer or say like a vanilla flavoring syrup, something like that, um, would only improve it from that aspect. Um, more of a traditional here is we're drinking it straight black. Mm -hmm. uh, one other thing is it's more of a coarse grind for like traditional drip coffee or a Keurig. Um, so if you want to use in, say, like an espresso machine, you'd have to grind it further. Um, but it seems like it would probably brew really well in like a cold or a French press or like cold brew as well. Uh, but yeah, we'll just zoom in here just so you can kind of see some of the ways they talk about doing it. And then uh, if I can get the side here, uh, just a few different types of the mushrooms. Uh, there'll be a link to this in the description down below if you want to check it out. It is vegan, as you can see. Uh, yeah, if you like this, leave us a thumbs up and subscribe. Thanks.